Hello everyone, welcome back. So you can see I'm playing Doom Eternal again, and today I'm going to be showing off the Pain Elemental. Yeah, I just did the Slayer, which, decently well, but again, as I mentioned in my two previous videos, not easy to play as the Slayer. It's like playing the campaign on one of the highest difficulties, essentially. Unless you get some poor demons, then, you know, it could be pretty easy. But for the most part, it is heavily stacked against you. Yeah, the Pain Elemental is actually a pretty cool one here. So I'll show you with his skill set. This is the one that I use, the Summoner. As you can see, he can summon three demon types, and then he has a healing zone as well. So he's more of like a defensive one when you have it on this mode. Yeah, he's... Oh, that's the classic Doom guy. How did he get that? Maybe that's from Campaign or something, because I have not seen that in the unlocks. But anyway, the Pain Elemental is very cool. He can fly around, he can shoot those flaming skeleton heads at you. He's probably my favorite or my second favorite. I would say so far, I really like that guy there, the... What was his name? The Mancubus. <laughs> I really like playing as him. He has a flamethrower, and he can shoot flaming balls at you. And he also has a double jump, but he does it by blasting the guns down on the ground. So he actually loses his ability to shoot while he's doing the double jump, and then you don't regain it until you land. So he's a little more difficult than the other mobile ones. And of course, he's a huge target too, <laughs> so that stands out. Yeah, this lobby music is always so cool. I'll pump it up a little bit so you can hear it. Yeah, gets you amped up. <laughs> and my guy's laughing. Yeah, the lobby music changes. I think it alternates between like five or so different songs. But they are all very bass heavy. Very thumping and cool. Spawn some demons around here. Yeah, you'll notice right away this guy's main perk is that he just flies constantly. <laughs> you never have to land. It's not like the jetpack one, the Revenant. You can just fly all over the place. Oh, and this guy's gonna die so fast. Whoa, he's hit me with like a grappling hook or something. Yeah, as you can see, he's getting overwhelmed pretty easily. <laughs> it's one thing about the Doom Slayer is that you are horribly outnumbered, so you have to just be fast and be skilled. Which is harder to do than it sounds. <laughs> Whoa, I'm going to dash out of here. Yeah, I only have one... Oh, there I go. <laughs> I only have one dash, so I need to conserve it when I can. Whoa, what the hell? Why is this... What? <laughs> what What was that guy doing? He's just standing there. The Slayer had, like, no health. I don't know what that was all about. <laughs> Fit meatball. Your aerial dash ability recharges faster. I like the little emblem that you have for it, too. You know, I'm going to do buff minion since he's the summoner. And then maybe bigger bar after that. Yeah, that's one thing about this meatball here is that he is a big target. And he's not incredibly agile when you try to land or, you know, just move out of the way. He's not great at doing either of those. You can also drop down if you want to. Ooh. Getting some good hits on him. Whoa, what the hell? Why are you getting that close? What is your problem? <laughs> Give him some cover fire. <laughs> Yeah, look at this guy, the Marauder. <laughs> what the hell is he doing? <laughs> Alright, well, he's just stupid, so I'm going to keep that in mind. I'll try to stay as far back as possible. I don't know what this Orbital Defense Cannon's doing here. Or the Hammer of Dawn, I should say. Whoa! When did this happen? <laughs> he might just die on his own. I might not even need to do anything. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Oh, come on. Just a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> there we go. Yeah, see, that's how you kill a Slayer. I have no idea what this Marauder's doing. <laughs> Just keeps getting in to horrible situations. Your soul barrier projectiles leave hazards. Ah, oh, interesting. Very interesting. You know what? I'm gonna do... I'm gonna do bigger bar. Just to make myself a little bit more survivable. Yeah, see, there it goes again. Every time on round three, that thing happens on the D-pad. It happens every round three, and I don't know why. I don't know what's happening in the game code for that to happen. Let's see. Try to be a little more strategic. Oh my god, this Marauder sucks. Look at him. What is his problem? And I've played as the Marauder before. You don't have to, A, get that close. And then even when you do, he should be hitting him pretty heavily with those shotgun blasts. It's one of the most damaging things that the demon can do is that shotgun. Oh, nope, nope. Block it, block it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you are so dead. You are so dead. Yeah, there he goes. Wow, I was just... <laughs> 36 health. I was barely hanging on. 
Yeah, this guy, what is his deal? Alright, let's see. Baron of Hell is always good. Increase your damage output. Eh. Team heal, gain access to a heal that heals you. That's actually not bad. Eh, you know what? I'm going to do Baron of Hell just so I can show that off. It unlocks at a certain point in the match. Yeah, see, there it goes again. The D-pad and everything's flipping out down there. Yeah, the Baron's actually really good. That's why they make you wait like 30 seconds. Yeah, see, he fired the BFG at me, assuming it would do damage, and it did basically nothing. Whoa. Oh, you get out of here. Maybe that's what he's been hitting the other guy with. But he's just not dodging it for some reason. Oh, nope, block. Block the loot. Yeah. Oh, get out of the battle here. Drop some health down there. I'm going to stay in this bubble. Yeah, as I mentioned in my Slayer video, you can't really heal easily as the demons. So you have to utilize... Oh, Baron of Hell, go. <laughs> yeah, see, there he is down there. Kill that Slayer. Oh, you cannot get away from me. Oh, oh, oh I'm coming. Man, you do not get that dash back quickly. <laughs> Just kind of chase him around like this. Oh, oh, you were so close to death. You were so close to death. Oh, there he goes. I think one of my demons got him. Yeah, as it always seems to be, it is victory for the demons. <laughs> it is so difficult to win as the Slayer. See, I even had a pretty bad teammate there, and yet <laughs> we just completely cleaned house with him. He got one round out of four. Yeah, it is not easy to be the Slayer. One player added you as a booster. Hey. Yeah, that's a new thing in this game. You can add players as boosters, which I thought before. I thought I was giving them like an EXP booster, and I was like, why would I do that? <laughs> I'm going to save them for myself. But yeah, apparently you can add people as boosters, and what that means is that whenever they get EXP, you get EXP as well. And you can have three boosters at a time, so he could see my physical prowess, and that's why he added me as a booster. <laughs> yeah, see, it just said there on the tips, the BFG has no effect on the player demons. Which is something I wish I would have read before selecting the BFG. I mean, I guess it's good for crowd control, but outside of that, really not going to get much use out of it. There's another <laughs> dude skin there. All right, let the games begin. Time to hunt this slayer. And try to get him on the whole path that he's running over there. Ooh. Where'd he go? Oh, he went into the teleporter. You just gotta keep constant pressure on this man. Ooh, yeah, that's a good weapon. <laughs> that's the, it's like the rail gun in the other game. But it's demonified. Yeah. Oh, oh, he is trying to get me. <laughs> Probably not a good time to block his loot. I mean, he didn't really have anything on the map yet. Whoa. Oh, oh, nope, nope. I hit the wrong button. There we go. He's trying to do that to activate the barrier. Oh. I had a feeling that's where he was going, so I shot above him. Uh, I wish I would have blocked that loot, actually. <laughs> that would have been good. Yeah, see, it's good to resummon your demons in order to change their positioning, but the problem is it drops loot every time you resummon a demon. So yeah, definitely have to keep that in mind, which I will do... Oh, oh, block, block. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say I was going to block it there after summoning, but then it gave me a good opportunity with all that loot lying there, so I got a double benefit off that. Oh, that was a lot of loot. Would have been good to block that. You cannot get away from me. Ooh. Just gonna keep the pressure on. Where'd he go? <laughs> he jumped right over my head. Oh, there he is. I don't have the block yet. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> that was a lot of damage there. Let me get in my little healing bubble. Alright, my other guy is not doing much to help me out here. <laughs> yeah, as you can tell, the guy that I'm playing is more of a support background fighter. He's not exactly get in the mix and, you know, attack the Slayer. He's more of summon demons that will put pressure on the Slayer and then also heal when you have the chance. Oh, 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 you are dead. You are so dead. Yeah, there he goes. See, that's how you do it. That guy opened up a barrage at the last second and just blasted him down.
I'm going to do buff minions again. It's always a good one to do when you're playing as the pain elemental. <laughs> Alright, there goes the d-pad again. This time on round two. Yeah, that is definitely a bug. <laughs> and the only thing that's bad about it, aside from it just being annoying, is that you can't actually select anything while it's doing that. So you lose a couple seconds at the beginning. Yeah, try to run that way. I saw you moving. Let's see, where is he going next? Haha, <laughs> right there. Yeah, run over the edge and try to get away. Oh, you fool. Where is he at? Yeah. Yeah, you should try to get relatively close as this guy, because those things are hard to shoot from a distance. But you don't want to get too close, because he has the super shotgun, as well as many other close-range dealing weapons. Oh. <laughs> Got a little loss there on the aiming. Oh, you fool. You ran right into the arachnid. Oh, that was a good shot. Oh, another good shot. Come on, just a couple more of those. Uh, I'm going to block his loot. Yeah, there we go. Put that there, put that there. Oh, you were so dead. You were so dead. Where is he at? Yeah, come on. Yeah. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that was tense there. <laughs> trying to chase that guy down. Yeah, see, it's good to resummon to apply pressure, but keep in mind, you are technically helping them in a way. As long as you block the loot, you should be fine, but... You know what? I'm going to do the fit meatball. That seems to be really good with this guy. I need to be able to dash more. Since he only has one dash, he's not as agile as the other ones. Alright. Put that guy down there. Oh, I'm going to put this guy right there. Kind of block the central zone. Put the shield brothers over here. Make him jump up there. Oh, he went the wrong way. Whoa. <laughs> not today, my friend. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that thing does come by a lot quicker. Oh. Where the hell? He is so fast. <laughs> it's hard to keep a track on him. And the problem is this guy's only main attack is shooting those skulls, which is also not very accurate and it's pretty slow to fire. And you can't do it that often, so you're heavily limited on your attacks as this guy. Whereas the guy with the rockets can fire two rockets at a time, fire a rocket barrage. Yeah, you definitely have a lot more options with the other guys, but this guy's flying definitely helps him out. So, you know, you have your good and the bad with all the demons. Oh, you oh, you were so dead. Oh, you were so dead. I'm gonna block his loot. Yeah, no loot for you. Oh, he's dead. He is so dead. Look at this. Yeah. Yeah, when I saw him get surrounded by those demons, I knew it was over. Yes, fire your barrage off. Yeah, I would say the death rate is probably 90% for the Slayer. It just, it seems like there's almost no way to get a full three-win victory. Alright, so that is it for the Pain Elemental. I'll definitely be back with the other demons. I'll probably run through the whole roster, actually. I might as well, I'm already halfway there. So yeah, stay tuned for that. And maybe some Campaign as well, and also some Doom 64. I don't know where I'm going to throw those in, but... Definitely going to get around to them at some point. Anyway, hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in those videos.